Hello, my name is Bill and welcome to Mind Your Crypto. Today we have Pepe daily update. Pepe has managed to make it, to make it into the Binance listing. And this is why we are pumping right now and before a plus 49% in just four hours. This is insane. Before we continue, do not forget to join our monthly subscription. Patreon slash Mind Your Crypto. Easy Profits Crypto Premium Group on Telegram. You will try it and you won't regret it. The third tier has everyday trading scalping strategy. It doesn't matter if the market goes down or up, you still make profits every single day. Thank you so much for watching. Have a fantastic day. Let's start. So Pepper right here, crazy pump when the announcement was announced. Actually, when it was announced, the listing of this coin we would be blowing up however right now the case is what are we going to do next we are going to draw the fib from the bottom to the top and you can see that right here to the top that we had actually back on today okay we might be breaking this top and the support levels will change however right now i'm having the support level, uh, levels mostly because of the risk that we are having. Pepe has managed to ignore every single risk, okay? So I do not count so much that we have this crazy risk. Many people believe that Pepe could actually go to the point 4 O's, 43 and so on. Sorry, 5 O's, okay? 43 may be 0.5 O's, 5. Some people think that Pepe will eliminate 1 O and we will have 0.4 O's, 1, let's say, for example. Let's see a little bit the truth and the logic way of Pepe. So right here, Pepe is insane, right? Has been going pretty, pretty amazing. The support level that we could be seeing if we correct is the 0.5 was 231764. Be careful because if we go down, this will make it as a support level, a huge support level though, and we might be pumping from here. Okay, so from 0.5 O's 23.17.64, we might be having another huge pump. So I am a little bit concerned about Pepe in the short term, but I do not think that right now it is so bearish. Okay, despite the fact that we are having a risk, despite the bearish or say divergences, I do not think that Pepe is so bearish right now. Huge volume coming in a little bit lower until now in this four hour frame. And in the daily frame, of course, we have a high risk. We cannot see the real risk. It is very hard to predict Pepe in the uh, mid term. However, that's why we are going into the one hour frame and so on. So you can see some important support levels. Now, what happens if Pepe goes all the way up? The next target is the 0.50343.46, let alone be the 0.50.52. This would be your two selling points, okay, if we manage to go up. But if you see a correction coming in, for example, in the lower time frames, we are getting rejected. And in the 15 minute mark, for example, we are going to lose the support level. If we lose it in the 15 minute mark, then be prepared that we might be facing the second support level that we are having, which is the point 4023.1764 into the one hour scale. Okay. However, if we hold that, this works like a pivot point, a bull pivot point, we could be going higher. Now, if we break this in the 15 minute time frame and we make it as a support level, be prepared that Pepe will be going to the point 5043.46 and the point 5052.56. Um, 71. Okay, so these are the exact targets, the resistance and support levels. I would advise you to take some profits around there if we manage to be so bullish. I would advise you, um, if you want to long it right now, wait for the confirmation of this top, then we will prepare for another pump. Do not forget to join our monthly subscription. Thank you for watching. Have a fantastic day and see you soon. Bye.